um, feeding a dependent resident and feeding a dependent resident requires PPE because this patient is in isolation I'll perform my hand hygiene then I'll put on my uh, isolation gown make sure you tie the strings on the, by the neck and the strings by the uh, in the back and then I'll put on my face shield and then my my gloves. And make sure the gloves cover the sleeve of the the sleeve of the gown. Okay, and then you are ready to feed Susie. Hi Susie, my name is Mary. I'm the aide today and I'm here to uh, help you eat. I'll get my uh, Get the tray and the meal. We are using Susie, but on the actual testing day, it will be uh, a real actor. I'm gonna raise up Susie to uh, a 90 degree angle so that she doesn't get choked on her food or she doesn't choke on the food. I think that's high enough. And so before we get, I need a barrier for her clothing. To protect her clothing. And I need to wash her hands. So I need to wash your hands before you eat. And then I'll dry them up. I'll wash the other one. Yeah. Right. I have to verify that this is Susie. So this is Susie. Uh, if she can tell you her name, that would be wonderful. But you have to verify if that's Susie. And then uh, you have to explain to Susie what she's getting or what diet she's on, which is mechanical soft. And um, she's getting, she's going to eat, Susie going to eat apple sauce. We'll have some water. And we pretend this is apple juice. And then you can bring a, your chair close by. And then I can sit by the eye level. All right, Susie, what do you want to start with? How about some water? And then she says she's going to drink some water. And she will take a couple of sips. And Susie, we're gonna try some apple um, apple sauce. So you give her a couple of spoons of uh, spoonfuls of apple sauce. So then she will eat. Susie will take another bite. Susie, what do you wanna drink? I want some apple juice. Alright, so we're gonna drink some apple juice. Here, Susie, drink some. 
Then she would bring some. I'll give her some more apple, apple sauce. At this, um, at this time, I can wipe her off. I'll give Susie her, I'll give her some more water. Susie, do you want some more? No, I'm done. And then I'll give her some more apple juice. Last one. And then she's done. Then I'm gonna wipe her off. Okay, I'll get rid of my barrier. And I'll move her with the uh, table. And then I'm gonna put to the, uh, I'm gonna put the head of the bed just a little bit down. Why? Uh, in that way, she uh, I don't remember. can digest her food <laughs> and prevent reflux. Uh, uh, prevent a heart burn. Okay. I'll get rid of my um, used linen. And at this point, I can record how much she ate. Uh, from the upper sauce, which is the solid part, also she had about twenty-five percent. Anywhere between twenty-five percent and fifty percent would be okay. Okay, so I will put my fifty percent here. I'll say twenty-five percent. Then from the glass of the uh, one twenty glass. I would say she had about half, half of the 120, so that would be 60. So out of the 120 glass, she had 60. And then from the 240 glass, our estimate is also half. So the half of 240 would be 120. So I have to add how much she has uh, consumed. So the 120 plus 60 will give us 180. So the total that the state will be looking for will be 180 and then the 25%. And of course, I'll put my name and sign down below here. And then I'll put away the tray. I'll give Susie a call, right? Yeah, Susie, use the call, light. call me if you need me. And then at this point, I can take off my PPE. I'll take off my gloves first. Then I'll go ahead and take off the gown. Is the gown or the shirt? The gown. Make sure that you don't touch the front of the gown. And you can fold it. And then you can go in the hamper. You can take off your face shield. And then I, can, I will perform hand hygiene. And that will be the end of the scale.